today the alternative marine power is a technology and one of our main strategies for reducing the disbursement of ship emissions in this port complex. Instead of running on diesel power while at berth, AMP equipped ships plug into the power grid, virtually eliminating ship emissions while at berth. Electrifying our port has been an initiative here since Cavatec and Port Engineers officially flipped the power switch on AMP back in year 2004. Of course, until now, one of the drawbacks of AMP was that it's technology that was invisible and unknown to the general public. This AMP educational exhibit solves that issue and will help the Iowa, Port of Los Angeles, Cavatech, and a community of technology suppliers and contractors here today tell our story of how Shoreside Power Technology has helped us to substantially reduce ship emissions here in America's busiest trade gateway. These are all folks, uh, a lot of you are here represented today. Thank you for what you did in connecting this shore power. It, it made it possible for us to get off of generators, um, which is enormous impact on our organization. We owe you a, a debt of gratitude for assisting us in pulling that off. We are here today together as a celebration of what is possible by pulling technical expertise and the will of doing something positive. Back in 2004, Shore Connection was just in use for uh, U.S. Navy or other Navy and Port of Los Angeles was the first worldwide port in introducing the AMP technology for the container vessel. Shoreside powering this historic attraction provides a range of benefits, but one of the best is that it puts the Iowa in good company with many other commercially active ships that call here at America's port.